There has been a large increase in people utilizing Tulsa's Etch to Protect program after last week's nationwide catalytic converter raid, including arrests here in Oklahoma. We reported on Etch to Protect. It's a service to get your catalytic converter marked with your vehicle's VIN number. Two News Oklahoma senior reporter Justin Ayer spoke with Tulsa Crime Stoppers about why leaders feel catalytic converter thefts are here to stay despite the big raid. Here at Bill Knight Ford, staff say it's a pretty simple process. In fact, they say they do about 15 on any given Saturday. If you come over here, you'll see how it's done. They'll lift the car up, they'll etch the VIN number into the catalytic converter, and then paint over it yellow. As you can imagine, it's cool. Bill Knight Ford is happy to protect your catalytic converter. It's all makes and models. We don't, yeah. you know, it doesn't have to be a Ford. Bill Knight and his team have etched 200 vehicle VIN numbers on catalytic converters since its August inception. That's where we're putting the etch right here. More than 400, counting Fowler Ford, Toyota, Don Thornton Volkswagen, and Jackie Cooper Infinity. After the big arrest last week, we noticed that the, the spike in calls again. A deterrent measure. If it does get stolen, now I've got a VIN, I can tie it back to a vehicle. Tulsa Crime Stoppers Executive Director Karen Gilbert gets all the customer requests. Even though we and Tulsa police had that big bust um, here in the Tulsa area, that doesn't say that those are the only ones that are out there doing this. I told you U.S. Attorney Clinton Johnson says catalytic converters involved in last week's raid are evidence and won't go back to victims. He says he expects a large decrease in those crimes. Do you foresee that happening as well? There's always going to be those uh, those players out there that are always going to try and do what they can to, to steal. Remember, this service is free, and you don't have to be a buyer of Bill Knight or any of the other dealerships. In Tulsa, Justin Air, 2 News, Oklahoma.